Welcome back to another Love After Lack of Recap. We're going to catch up with Joy Nomi and Red on season whatever, episode 9. So remember in the last episode, Joy dropped Red off at the hair salon. It was going to take two hours to get his hair done, and he called Sugar Mama number one, or one of his sugar mamas, and she has no idea about any of them. So now in this episode, Joy picks him up and she's like, there's my baby. You look so good. She drives him back to his mom's house and the mom is so happy. She's like, yes, I finally get to hang out with my son. Finally, after 10 years of not being able to see him or talk to him, he's finally here. My baby boy. The whole family's there excited to finally spend some time with Red. Now, what they don't know is they're trying to get out of there as soon as possible. So they're all sitting down in the living room and one of the cousins is like, oh, we're doing this tomorrow. You're going to come, right? And he's like, um, uh, you know, I mean, and he looks right at Joy Nomi and he's like, I think we're going to leave tomorrow. And his mom's like, wait, what? Tomorrow? You just got out yesterday and you're leaving tomorrow? And he's like, yeah, this is my new beginning. I'm 30 years old now. And when a man turns 30, you know, this drive kicks in and I'm ready to go. And his cousin is like, but Red, we waited 10 years for you. And he goes, I know that breaks my heart, but I gotta go. And his mom's like, what the hell is going on? His cousins are literally begging him to stay just a little bit longer They're like, you don't have to stay a year or like half a year or not even a month. We're just asking for like a week or two. Joy chimes in and she's like, you know, I'm going to make sure we go home and give him everything he needs. You know, I'm going to take good care of my man. And the cousin wants her to shut up. She's like, you should be encouraging him to spend some time with his family. And the other cousin's like, yeah. We can help you stay out of trouble. We can get you uh, situated and blah, blah, blah. And he's like, no, no, I'm ready to get the hell out of Missouri and start my new life. We're just asking for at least two weeks. Two days, like, you understand, I've been waiting this since I was eight. Joy got to go back to work, you know what I mean? I'm so disappointed. Ten years I've been through hell and back. Ten years. And you mean to tell me you're going to jump up and go to New Mexico in two days? And this whole time, Joy doesn't say a word and she's just waiting for Red to like wrap it up. God, this part was really, really interesting because I would normally say like as the girlfriend or the fiance, if you want to make a good impression on your future in-laws, you should be the one encouraging your man to stay, spend some time with the family. You'll come back in a week or two to pick him up. But then to be fair, she has to go back to work. And they just have to go. And the family's super upset, very, very pissed off. And his mom can't even speak because she's so upset. And Joy Nomi is like, you know, we just want your blessing. Girl, do you think you're going to get their blessing right now? No, no, they hate you. <laughs> they literally hate your guts. And one by one, they all storm out. The It's first the cousins. And then the mom's like, yeah, I'm not going to deal with this. And so she storms out and it's just Joy Nomi. And Red in the living room. And I have to say, I did kind of appreciate Red when he um, told them not to make him choose between his family and his wife. Because then ultimately he's going to have to choose his wife because that's his new family. I can't be torn between my, my wife and my family. I can't be, I can't do that. I have to choose my wife because my wife is my life. My, my so, son is my life. And I agree with that. However, I do understand his family's frustrations and hurt because, you know, they were waiting for him. For, were they really waiting though? I don't know. I don't really know their dynamic and, and their relationship. But if they were super close and they grew up together and they were waiting for 10 years, I would, I mean, especially the mom, I would understand why they would want to spend a little bit of time with him like before he moves. But ultimately he is an adult and it's his decision and they can't really get mad at him for that. Is giving Louie and his mom, and by the way, I haven't talked about them. I've been dying to. So if I find the time this week or next week, I'll talk about Melissa and Louie. But I don't know. What do you guys think? Are you on the family side or are you on Red side? Oh my God. So then his sister, Destiny, finally comes in with three boxes of pizza. She's ready for the party to start. But then she sees the mom freaking out outside and the cousins all mad. So she walks in and she's like, what the hell happened? 
so then Joy explains to her, you know, everybody's upset that we're leaving and, you know, they want him to stay. But, you know, I have to go to work and we're starting our new life. He's adopting Sway and we're going to be the perfect little family. And Destiny's like, well, you know, I do understand where my family's coming from because they waited 10 years. And Joy Nomi's like, well, you know, we just want your blessing before we go, like completely ignoring that. (laughs) Destiny would also like to spend time with her brother, but she is handling all this so much better because she's like, you know what? I do want to spend time with my brother, but he's an adult and he made the decision to leave. So what can I do? Their mom walks back into the house and she just goes off. And they're basically going in circles, arguing back and forth. And Red has had enough. He finally gets up. He's going to leave, but he has to take a few slices of pizza first. (laughs) So he grabs some pizza and they leave the house and Joy drives the getaway car. I don't feel like I'm welcomed into the family. I don't feel like they even like me. You think? On top of your damn wife, you ain't even married. Well, that's it for today's recap. Let me know all your thoughts in the comments and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.